Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Sorry Sam Beer Reviews. Woo! I hope you guys have been enjoying uh, Thanksgiving and are getting into the festive holidays because I know I am and I'm excited because I'm going to be trying to be doing some more seasonal Christmassy drinks, uh, drinking games, beers, all that jazz. But thank you again for so much for clicking on the video. And please leave a like, comment, and subscribe and tell your friends. It really all does help. It, I'm having so much fun with this. And uh, we're doing a little bit of a different episode today. I'm only going to be doing one beer. You guys seem to be liking the shorter videos, so I'm going to try to keep it shorter. Then, of course, for like the drinking games and stuff, I'm going to, you know, I'll fulfill whatever needs to be. I'll, I'll film whatever needs to be filmed and stuff like that. And I do have more of those coming up because I know you guys all like those. And uh, so without further ado, today we're going to be going, and I might as well just start changing myself to Sour Sam Beer Reviews because it has a nice ring to it. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm going to be doing another sour, and today I have a special sour. It's called Unicorn Farts by Dewclaw Brewing Company out of Baltimore. And this is also a collaboration with Diablo Donuts. And what's crazy about this beer, um, as I was reading it on the can, there's actually glitter in it. And I'm, I'll do the best I can to get a shot of that and figure out how, because I was reading um, you need to have it so, so I'm going to flip it upside down now. It needs to be turned upside down to actually kind of get the glitters in the can. And uh, I, lo I love the can. There's a unicorn farting around on it. I don't know how well you guys can see it, um, but I'll get a closer up shot of it and stuff. It's, <laughs> it's so cool. It's such a fun, a fun can. There's a nice story on the side. I'm not going to read it this time, but I'll leave it up if you guys want to pause it and stuff like that and do call brewing company always makes good stuff so um i'll have it i'll swirl it for a little bit see now i'm just afraid the beer is going to explode all over me from doing this but it says it says for doing it uh well i read it somewhere and you'll just have to believe me um so yeah but that's exciting so here goes nothing Certainly don't see any sparkles in the beginning. So I'll give it a nice healthy pour. Since I do plan on drinking this whole thing. Let's see if I can get any of the swirls. Any of the sparkles. Uh so nothing on first glance. I read somewhere that you need well, you know what? I'm gonna get a separate shot of it and I'll put it right here. Glitters. Um, <laughs> I heard it's, it helps if you have like white under it and stuff like that. Oh, we'll move on to the smell test. Put that, sorry, no ASMR for you guys today. Mm. Get, clear up the nostrils. Mm. Okay. Oh, it smells. It smells almost like a soda. It kind of smells like a spray. So Shannon decided to join me because she wanted to try it out. Now I know you don't like sour beers, so this is probably going to be disgusting for you, but we're going to share the unicorn farce together. So do you want to smell? I smelt it and it almost smelled like a soda Ooh, it to me. It smells good. Right? So without further ado, I guess cheers. Mm. It's tart. It's definitely tart. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely, definitely a sour and it's tart, but I like it. Um, again, I know you don't like sour, so yeah. if you want, you're good. You can go get ready. I know I, inter okay. I interrupted you. Shannon's going to work, so. There you go. It was, is, is interesting. There you go. But a different perspective. But it's sparkly. It is sparkly. So that was Shannon's portion of the, view, of the <laughs> review, and she does vote and can confirm is sparkly. There is glitter in it. Uh, it's definitely a very tart. Um, sour and I personally I like it there's not I don't want to say it tastes too much like a donut because that's kind of what they're going for um I don't taste a donut I take it's definitely fruity it's kind of smells you know like a soda which is really interesting normally you want to get a beer that smells like it but it's it's okay it's good I like it you know I wouldn't I wouldn't probably there are better sours out there I've had a lot better sours but this is a good one, and I think it's, I don't know, it's such a fun can that I definitely think, and there's glitter in it, so you'll definitely, you know, 
it's it's something just to try out, just to say you have glittery beer. If it is edible, and I will let you guys know on my next video if my pee has glitter in it, so there will be a little science experiment for you. Um, but overall, I'm gonna give it a. I'm gonna give it a. a, a uh, I'm gonna give it a um, 7.5 farting unicorns across the sky uh, out of 10. Because it, it's good, but it's nothing I've had better. And I was really excited about a donut tasting beer, and it definitely doesn't really taste like a donut. But overall, it's not bad. So, with that being said, we'll go into the final part, because I don't want to chug this because I spent $9 on it. And I keep buying all these expensive beers, it's killing me. So, so that was our unicorn fart sour beer review by the Duke Club Brewing Company. I don't know why I couldn't get that out in collaboration with Diablo Donuts. Um, it was really good. So again, I paid a lot of money for it, so I'm not going to chuck it. So I poured a mystery beer instead, which may or not may or may not be this beer in my hand. Uh, <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. And please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. Let me know what other stuff you want me to drink, whether it be beer reviews or if you guys have a drinking game you want me to check out or a beer challenge. I'll do anything. Um, and I know you guys like me chugging and stuff like that. So sorry, Mom, but start calling people out for me. I, you know, I'm still calling out Badlands Chugs or I don't know, anybody who really wants to chug with me, I guess, or anything like that. Now my cats are freaking out. So that's cool. <laughs> Maybe they'll chug a beer with me. So without further ado, again, I'm going to give this guy, a, it was a pretty good beer, but I've had better, but definitely go check it out. I did manage to get a little clip of the sparkles, so that's cool. So thank you guys. Oh, and finally, final thing before I chug this, um, I've been getting a lot of uh, constructive criticism on my name, Sorry Sam, so I'm going to leave it up to you guys if you guys like Sorry Sam or if you want me to change my name to something up. Somebody mentioned Sam Society or anything, you know, I I may or may not be changing my name. So just, you know, let me know. Let me know if you, anything. It could be funny, Sam the Beer Man. I know that was one of the, the things on Keith's live stream. So we'll see. But enough rambling. Cheers, guys. Have a great rest of your day. And I look forward to drinking with you guys some more. Cheers, guys. Have a good one.